Controversy building over whether to bring President Barack Obama's presidential library to Chicago. At, that, issue, at issue, the proposed locations in Washington Park and Jackson Park. CBS 2's Roseanne Teyes is outside a hearing in Jackson Park tonight. Hi, Roseanne. Hi, Marissa. Hi, Rob. The focus of this hearing tonight is to gauge community support for the University of Chicago Presidential Library bid. Would it be a huge economic boost or would it rob community members of this precious parkland? Or as one group protested tonight, should the University of Chicago be more focused on other community needs? Now, this is a die-in staged just outside the Hyde Park Academy. We're just across the street from the Jackson Park location uh, proposed for the library, where protesters are pushing for a trauma center for adults at the University of Chicago instead. Uh, they say that young shooting victims are transported all the way to the north side when there should be one here. They say a trauma center should be a priority and are against the library plan. I think it's unfair of the university to deny life-saving service to its neighbors while it is trying to reap prestige and honor by being associated with uh, Barack Obama through his presidential library. Now, mayoral candidate Bob Fioretti was also here tonight. He came with a busload of folks. He is against this plan, again, saying that it takes this valuable parkland out of the hands of the community and uh, gives it to this to this library project. There were several busloads of uh, critics and supporters of the plan that arrived here tonight. They have packed an auditorium. That hearing started at 6 o'clock, and we'll have much more on it tonight at 10. There is one other hearing tomorrow, I should mention, in Washington Park at the field. House. Live outside the Hyde Park Academy, Roseanne Teas, CBS 2 News. Rob, Marissa. All right, Roseanne, thank you.